Hello guys, Spidey came back with another video, and today I'm doing uh, a review on my Defining Moments Undertaker. Here he is, uh, it's a really good figure, I love it, um, there's just some things that we don't, I don't like about it, uh, but anyways, let's get into the review. Sorry guys about that. Um I just I needed to do some stuff. But um anyways this figure it's really good. It doesn't come with any um accessories, which kind of sucks. Um I, I, well yeah, I'll just start with the downfalls. Um also you can't uh take off this jacket vest thing, which kind of sucks. Um but yeah, that overall just really sucks because you can't get cool wrestling stuff and you can just get some cool entrance. I mean, you can get cool entrance poses. Or, yeah, but if you like playing with the figure, you're not going to want this jacket on. And whenever I try to play around with this guy, uh, I don't know, he's kind of bothered me. I always had this jacket on, but um, it's all right. I just deal with it and... <laughs> My dog's running around. Um, this figure, it's got some good stuff. Uh, the detailing is really good on him. Uh, the hair, that's buzz cut, uh, buzz cutted, or whatever you, how would, I, however you would like to say it. It's very nicely detailed. Uh, the point ponytail, or whatever, how, whatever that is. Um, it's like I know it's, it's a band holding that. It's not a colored band, but, I don't know, just, I mean, it doesn't really matter, but, where, uh, the hair's really, looking really nice, his goatee beard is cool, too, uh, I like his elbow pads, I don't really, I don't know, I don't think, uh, he really wears them too, too much, but I know he wears them from time to time, um, and then, wait, oh, he fell, uh, and then he's got these weird, nipple hook thingies i don't know what they are uh and then it's got this cool like scaly like either a snake or like some type of feather type of look he was going for uh which is really cool that's a good thing uh i see they uh they tried their hardest on the chaining try to get it right here but uh eh, well yeah they tried their hardest honestly i i don't think uh, we could do it any better than them, because, uh, you know, well, actually, I don't know <laughs> at all, um, but his boots are looking really nice, the boots, uh, the buckles are really nice, too, they're nice paint, um, uh, it, I like his little symbol here, and he has them on both boots, and he's got these cool... I don't know what they're actually supposed to be, like buttons or something on there. Uh, he's got cool, I don't know if you can call these decals, but it's got these cool striped looking type of thing. It's got it on here too. Uh, yeah, no knee pads or anything, but, uh, and then this is the back. It's got some nice buckle detail. Uh, there's his booty. <laughs> um, but the, again, the boots look really nice overall. Um, just everything's cool about this figure and kind of the strapping around. Uh, the cape is some very soft and, like, not very thick, uh, cloth or something. I don't know what it is exactly, but it, it's a nice material for a cape. And he's got these cool things on the side. I don't know what they are supposed to be. Um, just some sort of pads on the vest. Again, this thing is connected with all of this. This is all his vest that he wore on that night. I don't have the box, so I can't read a bio to give you guys more information on this attire when he wore and stuff. And I don't have an analysis, man, because I'm in my mom's. And it's just me really here, and sometimes my sister will help out. But, um, you know, I try my hardest. Um... Anyways, this is just so good. Um, he's got detailing. I don't know if you can see it on screen. He's got like this neck. 
thingy. It goes all the way up to his neck. The underpiecing does. Um, I can't really see the underpiece too much, which uh, kind of sucks. Um, but if you have, like, if I had two of these figures, I take one and just cut off the vest. So then I could see it. Um, I, I mean, I could do it to this one, but I don't want to wreck the fig uh, figure in any way, or I don't want to take risks at, uh, with this figure. So I'm just not going to do that with it. But uh, the tattoos are looking really nice. The uh, MMA gloves are nice, but uh, you can see the strapping here on this side. It's up, so you can see the under tattoo, which just makes it look like um, some type of sweatband. Um, but, uh, I mean, yeah, it's kind of noticeable. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of noticeable, but, again, I deal with it. Um, I don't know. I don't actually think these are MMA gloves because they just don't look like MMA gloves. <laughs> if you get it, because usually MMA gloves, they got padding on the fingers here, and then they got padding here, and then there's, like, a line they were cutting through so you can move your hand. Does not look like an MMA glove. Um, I don't know if they're going for an MMA glove, but he, he usually wears them. So I think they were, but they just screwed up <laughs> really bad on the gloves. But again, I deal with it. Um, I want to see if the uh, the elbow pads are actually really nice. That there, it's now cushioning inside, which I, I mean it makes sense. You know, they're not gonna put in extra money just for uh, stuffing inside of this. Um, it's kind of barely even squishy. Uh, they got nice detailing and light wrinkling throughout it to make it more realistic, I guess. Um, again, you can't really bend it much uh, because just elbow pads for these Mattel figures never work out well. Oh, sorry about that. Um, yeah, they never just work out with having to bend the arms good. But uh, it's fine. You know, having these figures for a good amount of time now, you just get used to it and you just find out other ways uh, how to deal with the figure. Um, The face looks a lot like Undertaker. Uh, I don't know, is he trying to do some rock thing with his eyebrows? Or, I don't know. Um, Tell me if you see that in the comments below. Um, Anyways... Hmm. There's not much to go on this figure anymore. Uh oh, articulation. Uh yeah, his head barely moves. I think it's because of his hair in the back. That might be why. I'm not 100 percent sure. Uh, but and like you can't even move to side to side. So he's basically just looking down the whole time, all depressed. Um, he's got that good ab crunch though. Surprisingly, even with the vest on, he's got a decent one. Um, and then obviously, you know, I already showed you some of the articulation, how it bends, not much. Uh, the hands do go 360 and, oh, fell. Well, <laughs> screwing up today. And, uh, the hands do bend, um, goodly. It's not even a word, I don't know what I'm saying. Um, the, they bend well. My sister's saying something to me, but I don't understand. She's just She's being... saying well, not goodly. <sighs> She's always there to just correct me on everything. No, I'm just um, His legs, they... Can I do the splits well? <laughs> he does pretty good splits for his age. Um, And then, I mean, of course, this is probably a much older time of him when he was... A younger wrestler um and then as you can see it only bends out that far which ain't much unless you go like this then uh, yeah doesn't really work out well there and uh well of course we know how far it goes back just because of his uh butt <laughs> it doesn't go back at all really um the leg bends here it goes let's see how far we can get it uh really far so that's good um and then his legs, I can, yeah, I can actually get these down really easy, which the thing is, Mattel, um, it's really sometimes for some figures, unless it's like a base, a uh, base, uh, basic figure, um, it's kind of hard, like on my Sin car, I can, it takes uh, so much force just to 
put down his leg. Uh, again, no ankle pivot, just because uh, Mattel doesn't like doing that. <laughs> I don't know why. Add some ankle pivot, Mattel. Ain't gonna cost much. It might, but I don't think it will. Uh, anyways, that's basically my review. Um, uh, I'm doing a double upload today because it's, what is it? It's like 10.23. Um, so I'm probably going to do one later on today. I'm thinking like two or one. Yeah, two or one. I'm going to do another review or just some video. I don't know what it's going to be. Uh, but yeah, that's basically it for this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you're watching because I just saw my top five list got 11 views within 13 hours. None of those suckers subscribed. Subscribe, please. Leave a like. Comment, um, what you want me to have the second upload be today. Um, unless it's a toy hunt. I'm probably not going to do that until, what, well, like Monday. That's probably when I'll do one. Or heck, maybe even the weekend, if uh, I'm lucky. But uh, anyways, that's the review. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I basically said everything that you should do, hopefully. Enjoy your day, Spidey Gang. Be ready for that double upload. Peace.